guys, it's Rachel here with Senza Tempo Cunny Corso. So I know that I've had a couple people asking for a Batista video, and I will get you guys one in, but um, it's going to take more planning than what I have time for right now. So I'm just I'm just letting out my inside dogs. I'm going to get to the point <clears throat> where I can let out my other dogs out here but right now they're being let out in the back in the in that gated area that i created and i don't really have a way of getting them over here without um them having the ability to pee on my plants i don't know if you've noticed but there's no male mature males out here and the reason for that is because i don't want them peeing on all of my plants i've done a lot of gardening lately um, a lot of landscaping and all it takes is for one male to pee on it a couple times to kill it. And so I don't, I don't want that. <clears throat> Pardon me. Gabriel. So that's why, um, that's why there's no mature males out. Um, where? Right behind me, the one that I literally put out. Yeah, I'm not surprised. They, um, they have a ah! bad... Naughty. Quit it. Naughty. They, they have a bad habit of the chickens of following me. I don't know why they do that. It's a very bad idea. Especially when we're out here with the dogs. Not a cat. But it is what it is. Not a cat. So I've been um I've been letting nature take its course. I've got anything that I'm not breeding chicken wise, I've got out. Get and um, and unfortunately, if the dogs don't get them, the fox will. So, Nautica, Nautica. quit. <clears throat> no, I don't want my dogs. Oh my God, look at Roxy out she's there. Not even know where she's going. We don't even know where she found that bowl. That gross. Leave um, it alone. But she found it. She's very happy with Nautica. herself. No. no, hey, that's a bad dog, Freya. Freya. Don't get in trouble. Stupid chicken. Ah, ah. No. Girls. Bella Rose. Nautica. Preacher. Preacher. Out. Nautica. Girls. Out. Hey, what did I say? I will put you down. Do you want to stand me, Freya? Girls. Don't you touch. Spooky. No. Spooky. Boy, are you deaf? I didn't think so. Come on. I'm telling you, it, there's always one. There's always one. Roxy, I'm watching you, girl. Don't think for a second you're getting by me. And you. Sucks that I couldn't breed her. This girl Freya here. She's actually available if anyone's interested in looking for a for an adult. She's like two years old, so she's not full grown yet. She'll get a little bit bigger. But um, we tried to breed her twice to no avail. So so she is available. Listening to my chickens. <clears throat> I just mowed this yesterday. I mowed my lawn. And I, I picked up all the... There was a bunch of weeds and stuff. I, I paid a guy twice to come out here and mow because I was so busy. It was back whenever I had all the puppies. And I was so busy that I paid him to come out and mow... And, and I was like, look, things have gotten overgrown, just warning you now. So I was prepared. I paid him like mm, $60 over what he was asking um, to clear out the weeds. Well, he did not. He did not clear out the weeds. And he left this really high spot over on the other side of my barn over there. And so I'm thinking, okay, whatever, you know, maybe he didn't realize it was going to be that bad. So, you know, I'm trying to be nice about it. And the next time he calls me um, or checks in about it, I was like, look, um, yes, it does need to be cut, but 
I need to know, are you able to do the whole thing? And because my whole thing is like, I can do it. I have the same equipment he has. I have the riding mower. I've got all this stuff. Um, you guys at Freya, what did I say? Cut it out. She thinks it's a game. Um, anyway, so I let him know. I'm like, you know, um, making sure, confirming that he's going to get it all done. He said, yes, he did the exact same thing. He came over, he cut what he could. He left the rest. Ticked me off. Um, so yesterday I came out here and I did it myself. I went over the really high spot with my mower on like the five, I think it's like a five inch and then went back over it with the three. Um, and then I came out here bare hands and with my, um, hedges pulled up what I could with my hands, cut the rest with the hedges, cleaned all this out, used my weed eater all along this line here, all up against that fence line there. And then, um, I don't know if you can see, probably not. And I don't even think I filmed it anyway for y'all to see, but there was this really high spot over on the other side of the barn that was, um, bad. And then I'll show y'all what I did. This is my, can't quite see it, but this is my little rose garden that I built. I need to put some stone in, but, um, very happy with that. So, oh no, it's really starting to come together. It's really starting to look very beautiful here. So I'm really loving that. Been doing my best. Um, so what you doing, preacher man? Preacher man, boop, 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 a boop, 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 a boop, 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 a boop. Tell you what, he ain't no punk. He likes to try to dominate everybody he can. Oi. No, Freya. Kimchi. Kimmy kimchi. Yeah, she about to go into heat. Are you about to go into heat? Yes, you are. Yeah, I'm going to put her, I'm putting everybody to Primo Tali this season. It's his season. For those of you that don't remember Primo, he was the one that I called the Italian Labrador. I think we called him Ital. You, you be on my on my shoes. Y'all already busted. Look at my ghetto shoes. Look at that. They're torn, and they just did it again. They just stepped on it on the back of it again. I tried to tape it with ear tape because I have no shame. Um, but they just he just tore it just now. And these are like these are all, honestly. Um, Wildly enough, these are not Crocs. These are like an orthopedic version, which I love. They're very comfortable. Um, I've got to get more orthopedic shoes of different varieties because right now I'm kind of, I've only got two, two types of orthopedic shoes. One is these, the other are my um, Brooks. And it's kind of hard to, to wear everything I need to wear with them. So, mm. And my feet have been feeling better, but they're not quite healed yet. And, um, and so anyway, just kind of sucks, but it is what it is. <whistles> Getting older, man. That's the thing. In case nobody told you, and maybe you already know because you are older, but things, you're just like an old car, man. Things just starting to wear out and break down. There's nothing you can do about it. Really? Do y'all mind? Because that is actually for my kitchen. I don't know where y'all got that from, but you're not supposed to have it. Not everything is for y'all. Oh, Lord. Got that one. And that is hair, and I don't think that's good for your digestive tract. No. Yeah. Freya. Oh, Freya. They, um, so, this livestock guardian, his, his hair ate hey, Nirvana. Be gentle with him. Leave my baby alone. She's like, he's reckless. I know he is. Leave him alone. What's up, Velocity? What you doing, sweet baby? What you doing, sweet baby? <sighs> Don't sound like they're getting on it. Sounds like they're barking at chickens. What? No. Hey, get first of all, get down, preacher. No. Quit. Oh. Uh -huh, that's what you get. 
Alrighty. Preacher. Spooky Duke. Spooky Duke. Oh man. This these this ragweed has got me feeling some kind of way. How about you? Mm, no, I'm actually fine. You're fine? Yeah. What have you taken? Nothing. Nothing? Coca-Cola. No. Where'd you fight? It's right beside me. I appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Ain't no reason to take that thing to Delaware. She gave me a purse. She gave you what? A purse? She gave you a purse. A Michael Kors purse. A Michael Kors purse. Like Holy cow. Hey, preacher. Hello, sweet baby boy. Hello, sweet baby. Did you boo boo boo? Did you boo boo? Boo boo boo. You gonna bite your face? You gonna bite your face? Spookers! Spookers! Booger boogers! Booger boogers! Spooky dookie! What? Uh, I started using a purse, um, a, ah, no spooky. Um, I started using a purse, um, honestly around your age. I think I was pretty sure I was 19 when I got my first car yeah. and that's whenever I started. Cause you gotta, um, yeah, I see it. You gotta, um, you gotta take your ID and all that kind of stuff. And, um, you just, you gotta have something. Can I help you, bro? No, you're not getting that bowl. Absolutely not, preacher. No. No. He's like, I will lick the condensation. No, you go away, Bella Rose. Bella Rose. Yep. Look at Switch being so cute over there. Switch. Switcheroo! Yeah, she's calling, but I can't answer because I'm filming. I'm using my nose to focus. <laughs> Beezy. I think she's going to be our first primo litter. Uh, first primo breeding. I got to check her with ultrasound today, so we'll find out. And then we'll start taking deposits. Asia, what you doing, sweet girl? What you doing? Where's Memphis at? In the back. You think I don't see you over there? Gabriel, oh. you think I don't see you? Because I am watching you. I am always watching. Ah, oh. Keep it up. See what happens. He yeah, he does know better. Gabriel, he killed three chickens yesterday before I knew what he was up to. I just didn't know. He killed a black one around one side of the barn that I didn't see until I was cutting the lawn. <clears throat> he killed um, a barred one that had already been sick that I didn't like I thought it just died because it was so sick the day before um, and so I didn't I didn't count I didn't know about that one I found it but I didn't know that he did it but then yesterday I caught him in the act and he got he got his little I painted his back porch red as they say and, um, oh my god, look at this. Look how cute. Look at that cuteness. Can you ever... You're a funny girl. You're a funny girl, Nirvana La. Nirvana La, you're a funny girl. You're a dirty girl. Stinky booty. Stinky booty. Boo, boo, boo. 
Velocity's got a stick out there, big old stick. What you doing, Gabriel? You think I didn't see you? Huh? I saw you, boy. I saw you. Yeah, that's right. You can come over for apologies. But I did see you. I did see you. I did see you. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. Where's Memphis? In the backyard. Okay. Did I already ask that? Yes. Okay. That's my bad. Look at Spooky. He's trying to get some nose. Spookers! Look at that booty spooky boy. Oh, I love some spookers. Boop, boop, boop. Got your nose. And boop, boop, boop. Got your nose. <laughs> he looks like a clown. He's your baby boy. He's a spooky dookie. A spooky dookie. Come, spooky duke. <clears throat> Bro, I cannot help you right now where you are. Spooky duke. Spooky duke. <laughs> no. No. Get off me. Your nails are sharp, my boy. Watch out. Hop down. Hop down. There's a good boy. Oh, oh, he <laughs> fell down. He fell down. Did he fall down? Did the spooky duke fall down? Oh, sweet baby boy. Sweet spooky. Spooky dookie. Spooky dookie. He's a spooky man. A boo 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 boo. Boo 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 boo. Spooky duke. No, don't do it. You're going in the wrong area. Who? What? Where? When? Roxy? Dude, you're scratching me, and that I don't appreciate. No, thank you. Roxy! Roxy! You gotta roll the R. You gotta go, Roxy! Nope. Oh. Didn't even bat, a look. bat an eye? Bat an eye. Bat a look. Roxy! Roxy! Girl, first of all, you need to be taking your foundation off at night. I know, you can see it. You yes, see you're literally gonna cause your face to break out, and you don't wanna do that. Yeah, don't do that. I had to I had to go at my face last night with the thing to get the white heads out. Those um I have patches I can use. No, these are not for that. These are these are um these are for those hard ones. The only way to get them out I have one right here that's like way underneath. Yeah, the so the only way to do it is you use a lancet. It's called a blood lancet. It's really for pricking your finger, but you just prick the pimple and then uh and then and then it comes out i got a blackhead that way too dude i don't know she's very excited she's ex she's extremely excited with what she has who knows what it is but it's probably something gross oh here comes nautica nautica's like what you got yeah Look, look at BZ. BZ got a stick. Be easy, BZ. Be easy, BZ. Bro, I got eight up last night. Do you have any idea? I need batteries for my hot thing, for my little Bernie thing. Let me tell y'all what. I have like really, um, I have really strong reactions to bites, mosquitoes, whatever. And I've always been like a scratcher and then I get a scar and it's, it's, it's muy feo. It's very ugly. Um, and so I got this thing, this device on Amazon and it basically heats up and it like, um, just about when it starts to get painful and like actually burn, it stops. But it, it works so good, y'all. Like so, 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 so good. And I don't have like barely any, um, any scars from scratching. Plus, I've been getting my nails done. So my nails are like really dull, so they can't do anything anyway. These are my nails currently. And, uh... Dude, I've been getting scars on me too. You gotta use that, you gotta use the Bernie thing. Well, they're already scabbed. You gotta use the burn. Yes, dude. Yes, it gets hot. Like I used to be so bad as a kid that I would literally like my if I got bit like let's say I got bit in the in the leg like like right here like an in inner thigh or something it would swell up like yeah. that big. That's it would be like a baseball size swelling yeah. that I would get. And then you put the big old cross on it with your fingernail. 
No, I, yeah, I've done that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do the cross indent. Ooh, who got who? Who got who? Three of them. They tagged Oh, they got Nautica. Poor girl. They keep beating up on her. Look at her. She's just accepting it. Yeah, she must be really, like, coming into herself. She's probably about to come into heat for the first time. That's usually what happens is when a female starts to, like, become an adult. They pick on her. Yeah, she gets bullied quite a bit. Mm -hmm. That's Freya. Freya and Nautica. Poor Nautica, sweet baby girl. Oh, and now he's coming in. Oh, oh. Lucy's so bad. Yeah, she's like, not you, punk. She's like, you leave me alone. Nautica. Nautica. Sweet baby girl. Poor baby. Look at you. Look at you. Get off me. Don't you knock my... Get down, woman. Jeez Louise. Gabriel, where are you going? Where's he at? Oh, Preacher and Spooky Duke. I think it's fun for Preacher to have a puppy his size. Yeah, before. even though Spooky's... Ow! First of all, you almost got messed up. That hurt. Jeez Louise, does she scratch the crap out of me? It's not developed yet. Mm, get you, girl. For anyone who's wondering what happened to Blondie, I did have some questions. I still have Blondie, but she got overweight, like really overweight. And um, those of you that know, she had a loose hip. Um, wasn't dysplastic or anything, but she had a loose hip. And anytime she gets really overweight, I put her away. This time she did start limping on it. I mean, she got like, um, obese like I had Savannah feeding her and then on top of that what we didn't know was that she was going out into the back and eating all of the um eggs so she was like really I think it was like too much protein whatever she started limping so anyway um she's older now um that's the reality of the situation she's almost seven years old so um so I don't, you know, it is what it is. It's it, if she, if she was not overweight, I don't think we would have had an issue. So I'm not going to attribute it to anything. Plus she's done breeding and we've already hip tested her offspring and her grand offspring, so, you know, people can have opinions, but it is what it is. Um I don't I don't have any regrets um on using her, but you know, when you that's why it's so important to keep your dogs at a healthy weight because you don't know if there is something that you can trigger by just having them overweight. The dog will be perfectly fine so long as you don't let them get fat, and if you let them get fat, you can have problems. So that's kind of what happened with her. Um, you know, either way, she's got one really good hip, um, regardless. So I'm not really concerned about it. And she's she's not limping like she was at first. I thought it was pretty bad, but. Now she's, um, she's walking fine, but what I don't want is for her to overdo it coming out here, trying to push her weight around, being the, you know, um, the alpha female out here and, and stress it out. So she's older, she needs to be in retirement and that's what she's doing. She's resting and I don't want her out here with all these guys. So it just is the way it is. And she's pro and the thing with her that sucks is why we struggled with her is that she's prone to gaining weight anyway. She's prone to um, being on the thicker side. Uh, you, as you can see, Nirvana. Nirvana is a very thick female, not ob obese or fat or anything, but you know she's a thicker female. Hefe was a thicker male. Um, Blondie just tends to have some real thickness with her babies. Um, and uh, unfortunately, an appetite to go with it. And so you got to kind of watch her. And um, even Reese was talking about that with her daughter, um, Scoob. She has a, a blondie daughter, Scoob, and she's the same way. It, it's a, it takes a lot to keep her weight down. Um, so anyway, you know, it is what it is. 
but I'm um, just doing what I have to do to keep her safe and keep her healthy. And um, that's just always the way it is with me. So, oi! Oh, a nice stick, Spooky. Nice stick, yeah. We go fathead, Spooky Duke. Spooky Duke. Spooky's a giveaway. Did you give away? Did you get a mistake? Yes, you did. You got a good thing. Did you spooky duke? Did you spooky duke? Did you spooky dookie? Spooky dookie. Anyway, well, I'm gonna let y'all go. We got work to do today. I've got to finish up this area of weeds over here. Got to take these kennel panels down. I'll clean all this out. Get back to a very clean, fresh area. Put these kennels away. Um, so I got a lot of work to do, but that's how I do things around here. I'm always working. So anyway, I'm going to talk to y'all later. Bye.